is Katie. I just did my little posing for my thumbnail and for some reason when I do my poses and I'm like I always hold my breath <laughs> so then when I'm done I'm like <sighs> I don't know why I do that. I don't know why I do that. Do any of you guys hold your breath when you take pictures of yourself? I don't know if that's like a good thing or not. I have no idea. Anyway, I want to put lip gloss on. I just want to put on some Fenty. Uh, this is Sweet Mouth lip gloss. I like their lip glosses. Okay. Okay, great. Hi. So, if you watched a video from, I don't know, a couple weeks ago, I went shopping. And I think I titled the video like the worst try on haul ever because <laughs> I bought a lot of dresses. They're literally sitting right here because I have to return them. I'm going to return them today. But they were, um, they did not look good on me. A lot of you guys know I'm usually in like t-shirts and jeans, mostly black. I have denim on today though, blue, but um, mostly black. But um, just lately I've been in the mood to like change up my style a little bit. And so I wanted to get some dresses, got a bunch at Target, hated them all. Seriously, if you missed that video, I would recommend going to watch it because it's just me looking ridiculous in dresses that kind of looked like they were made for three-year-olds, but for adults. So uh, I decided today I wanted to run to TJ Maxx again. In that video, I went to TJ Maxx as well, but that was again a few weeks ago. So I wanted to go back today to see if they had anything. Do you want to guess what I ended up getting? It's a TJ Maxx Home Goods, by the way. That's why it says Home Goods. TJ Maxx. Do you want to guess what I ended up getting? I'll wait. I'll wait. Put it in the comments what you thought, what you think I got while I was shopping for dresses. Do you think I got a dress? Do you think I got something else? Let me know. Pause. Go comment. Okay. Now you're back. Hi. Um, the first thing that I got, which I usually get when I go to TJ Maxx, is my favorite face wipes. These are the simple face wipes. Take my makeup off with these, love them. And they had a two pack for $5. Uh, if you get these at like CVS or Target or Walmart or whatever, the cheapest they ever are is like $4.50 or five or $6 each. Somehow they had a pack for five bucks, so I picked that up. But also, I got a pair of black jeans, <laughs> which is, you know, not, not why I went in there. But I thought these were really cute. They're by the brand Edwin. They were $25. Um, they're a size small, which makes me nervous about jeans if they come in like small, medium, large, extra large. Um, but this small looked, cause like normally I would probably be like a medium, but this small looked pretty medium-ish. So got them to try on at home because the um, dressing rooms are still closed, but they are just like baggy-ish black jeans. Did I need new black jeans? Ah, uh, need is a, you know, a word that has different definitions. Um, but uh, I was kind of looking for one more pair of black jeans. So we'll see if these fit, you know, cross your fingers because <laughs> as much as I have an issue with dresses, I have an issue with jeans. It's very hard for me to find jeans because my hips are really narrow and my waist is not. <laughs> so a little bit more straight uh, in the middle part of my body. Um, and a lot of jeans, you know, go in at the waist and out of the hips. That's not my body type. So we'll see if those fit. But anyway, speaking of shopping, do you guys know that Mother's Day is coming up or did you guys forget? If I am your reminder, hello, it's almost Mother's Day. <laughs> One thing that a lot of humans really enjoy is jewelry. And I'm so excited because I am partnering with Ana Luisa Jewelry. You guys know I've worked with them in the past. I love their jewelry. I wear it all the time. They're based out of Brooklyn, which I'm from New York, so I mean, it's like one perk there. And their jewelry is really fairly priced. They have earrings, necklaces, rings, bracelets, and they all start at $39 and up. So it's super fairly priced whether you wanna buy something for yourself or give it as a gift. I think these are great gifts. I know I gifted my mom a necklace for Christmas, this past Christmas from Anna Luisa. And I think I got her earrings once too, I think. I love them so much because they have basic pieces, like everyday kind of basic pieces, as well as more standout pieces. And they're really good quality. They're made in limited batches. They're carbon neutral, which I think is very cool. I think, okay, I think that we should be celebrating moms and everyone every day. If you love someone, I think we should be celebrating them every day, but especially on a day like Mother's Day, like do something extra special, you know, do something extra special. And so if you know that your mom likes jewelry, I We'll have some links below because Anna Luisa is having a Mother's Day sale, 15% off. F 15. There we go. <laughs> I'm gonna do some close-ups on these pieces and tell you what they all are because I got a couple new ones. I got these earrings, which I love. I got this ring as well, which I really like because there's like this little 
can you see that little cutout in it so you could kind of wear it a couple different ways you could wear it on top or you could flip it around um, but I also like having them stacked um, and then I also got these oh, I love these these little like love knot studs earrings and these tiny little earrings are so cute they're like open hoops but they have a ball on them I think they are so cute. So the 15% off sale is going on now. The last day to guarantee that you'll get it by Mother's Day, the last day to order is May 5th um, in the States and May 3rd internationally, which you still have like a week or so to look at their website, look at all their jewelry, it's so cute. A lot of it is gold plated, which you guys know I wear generally gold, it's gold plated, really good quality and I really like them a lot. I wear a lot of their pieces like almost every day. And so I wanna thank Anna Luisa, I'm actually gonna be partnering with them for the next year, making a ton of videos showcasing their jewelry. And so thank you so much. Anna Luisa for sponsoring this video and then also making it really really a great gift for no matter what occasion but especially for Mother's Day like please like treat your mom to something really really nice you know and so I want to thank Anna Luisa again please make sure to check out their sale all the links and stuff will be in my bio and yeah it is 10 45 in the morning and um, I didn't eat yet but I really want to go to my favorite well I don't know I'm gonna say my favorite restaurant in Nashville because it's I don't know if it's my favorite but it's one of my favorite foods that I can get at said restaurant and honestly even calling it a restaurant is a little bit of a a push <laughs> but I'm very in the mood for this particular food so watch out later in the video because I'm gonna get it for lunch I'm gonna get it I mean it's 10 45 and it's a lunch food but I um, don't care what time I eat things. Like I'll eat chicken fingers at 9 a.m. Like I don't care. I don't think that breakfast foods are for breakfast or dinner's for dinner. I think it's whatever you want. Um, but I'll probably end up getting it around 11.30. So it'll be a little later in the video. But stick around if you want to see. I'm not kidding. One of my favorite foods that I've found uh, in Nashville. Um, but for now, um, I am, I'm gonna go to Target. Today's like a little bit of errands running around and uh, eating my favorite food really soon <laughs> okay so I'm gonna go for a second and then I will see you in a little bit hey guys so it's 12 30 I still have not eaten yet <laughs> and I also realized you guys are gonna be mad at me the last time I ate was like yesterday at noon so I had an accidental 24-hour fast um, I'm about to go get some food like I told you I'm gonna eat like one of my favorite foods today for lunch breakfast whatever I'm breaking my fast so it's technically breakfast um, but I'm gonna eat that soon but I just went to Target to return all those dresses and you know, it's Target. So you always go to look around even if you went to return something. I, uh, mistakes were made, I'm just kidding. Um, most of these things, most of these things are like, everyday use normal kind of things that I would buy but I figured I'll do a little Target haul before I go eat um, just to show you some of the stuff that I got at Target so first thing I got is tomato sauce in a can um, I really like to dip uh, fresh mozzarella in tomato sauce and then sometimes like I'll add it more to pizzas and I'm actually making a recipe soon like a real recipe um, maybe in a couple weeks um, that calls for tomato sauce so I wanted to have that anyway I got a bunch of these tunas that I eat all the time. You guys know I keep them in my car. I eat them when I'm hungry. I kind of want to eat one right now, but I'm going to wait. Um, I got Thai chili, which I really like, and a lemon pepper, which I really like, and a ranch. My favorite is the sweet and sour, but they didn't have any. And I have a couple in here anyway, but I always like to stock up these, at least at the Target I was just at are $1.29. I think some places they're a dollar um, or might be on sale for a dollar, but still $1.29 for a meal pretty good to me um, got some ketchup because we're almost out of ketchup and then you guys know about these things right I um, feel like I've seen some influencers and stuff talk about them these are the smart sweets but I never tried them myself and then a couple weeks ago tried them uh, really liked them bought two more these are insanely expensive fake Sour Patch Kids that aren't really sour. Cause I get, I like the sour one. I tried the sour one and just like the regular gummy bear one, but these are like, they want to be Sour Patch Kids, um, but they're nowhere near as sour, but they're just healthier. They're gluten-free, which you guys know, I don't have gluten. And there's only four grams of sugar, but it's real sugar. Cause I don't do fake sugar. It's real sugar, but it's allulose, non-artificial sweetener that's found in foods like raisins and figs. 
I don't know. So they're supposed to be healthier. You know what? I don't know what they are or not because I kind of don't care if I'm eating candy. I'm going to eat candy. Um, but sometimes if you can find one a little bit healthier, that's fine. But each one of these is $3 for this. $3. But again, I had one a couple weeks ago and it did last me like four or five days. I'm not someone like there's not a lot in here, but like most of the time that I'm eating sweets, I don't eat a lot of sweets at once. So I might only eat four or five of these, you know, so it did last me a decent amount of time but the whole bag is the serving size and it's 100 calories and four sugars oh no three sugars three sugars and apparently it's a, a non-artificial all-natural sweetener i don't know but they're good and i bought two more okay so that's all the food stuff um i also bought <laughs> the biggest scrunchie that anyone has ever seen. Um, this is by Kristen S. They seemed to have a bunch of different options, but this was the only one left, but I love big scrunchies. I love them. Um, and this is like a, like an, an animal print of some sorts. Um, and I think it's gonna be cute. Look how big this thing is. These last few purchases were in the little dollar spot, which doesn't always get me, but sometimes it does. Um, but I'm actually really glad that I found these. I found these like wet dry bag things for toiletries and they were only $3. Cause the dollar spot has like $1, $3, $5 or whatever sections. Um, but these were $3. I got two different colors just cause they had two different colors and I wanted to get two anyway for traveling to throw um, my toiletries in. Literally the last time I had my toiletries in a bag, um, they spilled and got everywhere. Um, and so if you have a bag like this, that's like this plasticky kind of material, um, easier to clean, easier to wash. Um, so I do recommend some sort of bag like this if you have anything that could spill specifically toiletries. What is, oh, I tried to cross my legs and there was something in the way. It was my phone. Um, anyway, so these were in the $3 spot. So if you are looking for inexpensive toiletry bags, we'll see how they, I don't know if they're completely leak proof with the zipper and stuff, I'm not sure. I don't know, but I thought they were cute and uh, definitely big enough to hold toiletries and stuff for traveling or, or for storage or whatever. I got those. The last thing, I got toy cars. <laughs> I got two so that my roommate and I can race <laughs> or whoever, whoever's around, I'm gonna be like, I have cars, can we race? Because apparently <laughs> this thing on the back, you pull it, and then it's supposed to go. Does it, oh, oh. And these were a dollar. These were a dollar. They had a bunch of different colors. I got two of them. This spins for some reason. You can do tricks or something, I don't know. But um, I just thought that this was like the cutest thing, especially for a dollar each. Cause I, you guys know this about me. I like toys and games and stuff like that. And so this seems like a fun thing to do, but I'm really excited about this. All right, so that's everything I got at Target. A little bit of like a random kind of haul, especially with those toy cars. I feel like getting food and getting like a hair tie and stuff, normal. But then like needing, I needed those toy cars. Those toy cars was also very hard for me to try to say, um, but I needed them and so, and they were a dollar. And I'm like, I'm already excited about them so they are bringing me $2 worth of joy already. So actually playing with them, I think is gonna be um, fun. Anyway, it's 1240. I haven't eaten in 24 hours. It was an accident. It was an accident. I like even knew what I was gonna have for dinner last night and then I just ended up not being hungry and I just didn't eat. And that's weird. Um, I need to go eat. <laughs> I need to eat. Okay, do you guys wanna guess? <laughs> All right, let, I'll give you some clues, ready? Of my, like, my favorite food that I'm really excited about going to eat. It is at a chain, chain restaurant, restaurant. It's one specific food. I do like one of their other things that they have, but this one specific food. If you make it at home, I think it could count as healthy. I don't know if getting it at this place counts as healthy. I'm not entirely sure. <laughs> but yeah, it's a chain that they don't have in New York. I know that much. I don't know if they have it out West, but I know that they have it like Midwest-ish and then down a little bit in the South. Like I know that Charleston had one. Um, Nashville has, well, Nashville proper doesn't have any. They have a couple like in the outskirts. I think there's like two or three like in the outskirts. So yeah, it's a chain and there's one thing that I like that if you make it at home could be healthy. Those are not good hints. Can I blame it on not eating for 24 hours? Anyway, let's go.
Let's go get one of my favorite foods. Hi, um, I have a gluten allergy. So okay. can I please just order a large side of chili? And if you could just mark that with a gluten allergy, I'd appreciate that. Yes, ma'am. Any uh, onions, cheese, or sour cream crackers? Oh, nope. Just the chili by itself. Thank you so much. Okay. Did any of you guys guess Culver's chili? Culver's chili. Okay. I didn't even know what Culver's was until about a year ago. Uh, maybe a little over a year ago. And now I'm obsessed with it. Their burgers are great. They have gluten-free buns and you can get, I think all of their burgers, uh, like, and all their toppings can be made gluten-free. And then their chili, you guys, their chili's gluten-free. Um, I got the large. Their chili is just one of my favorite foods that I've discovered in the last year. And it's one of my favorite foods <laughs> available to me in Nashville, <laughs> which might sound crazy, but I love it. I love it, I love it, I love it. Sometimes I do add hot sauce or cayenne pepper or black pepper. Um, sometimes I want it to be a little bit spicier than it is. But other than that, oh, it's just one of my favorite foods. I'm gonna have a bite. I'm gonna have a few bites. All right, I'm trying to hold it with my tendonitis hand. My tendonitis does not hurt very badly right now, but I don't wanna like think that I can hold this and then aggravate it. You know what I mean? Just resting it on my hand. Anyway. guys I just <laughs> I understand that some of you are gonna think it's really weird that I'm so in love with chili but I am if there's a Culver's around you because I know they're not everywhere please go try their chili let me know in the comments if you've had it because it's just one of my favorite foods I get it all the time um, Okay, my hand is starting to get aggravated a little bit. Tendinitis, that's okay. But also that's why before when I was saying restaurant, I kind of put it in quotes because it's fast food. I mean, it's a restaurant though, but I want to try to give you guys some hints. I really am curious if any of you guys guessed it. Because I can't remember if I've ever talked about it on YouTube before. And I don't even know if I talked about it on Instagram before. I'm not sure. So this is like my secret favorite food that I did not mean to keep secret. That's so good. I'm so happy right now. Like I already want to go back and get another one of these just to have. That's how obsessed I get when I really like food. All right, I'm going to focus on eating this chili, but I think I'm just going to end the video here. Thank you guys so much for watching. I hope that you enjoyed this super laid back like shopping vlog, but I didn't show you any shopping, so just <laughs> stuff vlog. Um, I really hope that you guys enjoyed it. Also, please remember that Anna Luisa is having their Mother's Day sale, 15% off everything on their site. And all those links are going to be in my description. If you're curious for Mother's Day or just, you know, if you want to buy yourself some jewelry um, or someone else, some jewelry makes a great gift. So I want to thank Anna Luisa again for sponsoring this video and for allowing me to be one of their partners now. And I really hope that you guys are subscribed to my channel for some travel videos, some lifestyle videos, some just hanging out with me vlogs. I really enjoy having you guys here. So thank you so much for being subscribed, for commenting, for liking this video, for hanging out with me. I really appreciate it. And I guess that's going to be it. Thanks again. And I hope you have a wonderful day. I love you. Jesus loves you. And I'll talk to you later. Bye.